So hello everyone and a very good morning to all of you. Welcome back once again to the session of PIB 24/7. मैं हूं मनीष मिश्रा and in this session as usually I will bring to you five important questions from the PIB news. So let's start with the session guys. But before we begin, if you are new here, you can subscribe to our channel and press this bell icon. And also you can join this Telegram group for daily quizzes and updated information. So let's start with question number one. With which country's postal service India Post has signed an agreement for electronic exchange of customs data related to postal shipments exchange between the two countries so India Post ne ek dusri country ke postal service ke sath ye agreement sign kiya hai so let's discuss with news and the country guys is united states so india post has signed an agreement with the united states postal service and for what purpose for electronic exchange of custom data related to postal shipments that is exchange between the two countries jo so, dono countries ke beech mein postal shipments hoti hain usse related jo custom data hota hai wo uske electronic exchange ke liye this agreement has been signed all right and what are the key points so guys the primary objective of this agreement is to facilitate the ease of exports for small and large exporters through postal channels jo छोटे और बड़े एक्सपोर्टर्स हैं उनके लिए जो ईज ऑफ एक्सपोर्ट है उसको प्रमोट करने के लिए दिस एग्रीमेंट हैज बिन साइन एंड दिस एग्रीमेंट विल मेक इट पॉसिबल टू ट्रांसमिट एंड रिसीव इलेक्ट्रॉनिक डेटा ऑफ इंटरनेशनल पोस्टल आइटम्स प्रायर टू देयर फिजिकल अराइवल एट दी डेस्टिनेशन मतलब कि उन आइटम्स के डेस्टिनेशन पे पहुंचने से पहले ही इंफॉर्मेशन उनके बारे में प्रोवाइड कराई करा दी जाएगी इन द इन बोथ द कंट्रीज and it would enable custom clearance of postal items in advance and it will also improve the performance of postal services of course in terms of reliability visibility and security okay so basically uh, isme ye jo points hai guys these are not important for exam this is just for your basic understanding ki ye agreement jo hai kis tarike se help karega to both the countries the question guys can be asked uh, like this one ki is tarike ka koi question pucha jayega agar is uh, news mein se koi question aaya to So guys, the country is what United States of America. Option E, the U.S. Postal U.S. Postal Services, India Post has signed this agreement. All right. And now let's move on to the question number two. So Ministry of Tribal Affairs, which is headed by Arjun Munda. Arjun Munda is the Minister of Tribal Affairs. His Lok Sabha constituency is Khunti, which is in Jharkhand. So this ministry has launched two centers of excellence for tribal welfare in collaboration with Art of Living. So I hope you all uh, have. heard of about the art of living which is headed by shri shri ravi shankar okay so the question is name the places where these centers have been launched kahan pe in dono centers ko launch kiya gaya hai so let us discuss this news so the ministry of tribal affairs has launched these two centers of excellence for the tribal welfare in maharashtra and jharkhand okay the locations are maharashtra and jharkhand are the locations all right and this has been done in collaboration with the art of living which is headed by Shri Shri Ravi Shankar. Okay, and moving on, let's discuss more about this. So the locations are Maharashtra and Jharkhand. Okay, Maharashtra and Jharkhand. Me, isko banaya gaya hai. And what are the objective of making these center of excellence? So for Maharashtra center of excellence, the basic objective is the training of ten thousand tribal farmers of Aurangabad district. Okay, so remember the name of the district also in Maharashtra, where in Aurangabad district, वहाँ के दस हजार farmers को training provide कराई जाएगी. दस हजार tribal farmers को training provide कराई जाएगी. on sustainable natural farming okay the training provided will be on the sustainable natural farming and what is the objective of the jharkhand uh, center of excellence that is for strengthening the panchayati raj institutions of five district covering 30 gram panchayats and 150 villages of jharkhand jo jharkhand ke 150 villages ko cover karenge five districts mein aur wahan ke jo panchayati raj institutions hai unko strengthen kiya jayega aur kaise strengthen kiya jayega how will they benefit the tribals So the panchayati raj institution, जितने भी पंचायती राज इंस्टीट्यूशन के मेंबर हैं या जो भी उसके पोजीशन होल्डर है दे विल बी प्रोवाइडेड अवेयरनेस अबाउट द स्कीम्स रिलेटेड टू द ट्राइबल पीपल अबाउट द बेनिफिट्स दैट इज प्रोवाइडेड बाय द सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट और द स्टेट गवर्नमेंट टू द ट्राइबल पीपल एंड देन दैट इन्फॉर्मेशन विल बी प्रोवाइडेड टू द ट्राइबल्स सो अल्टीमेटली ट्राइबल्स तक जो गवर्नमेंट स्कीम के बेनिफिट्स है वो पहुंचाने के लिए दीज पंचायती राज इंस्टीट्यूशन विल प्रोवाइड अवेयरनेस एंड दैट इज हाउ we uh, that is how under the center of excellence they will be strengthened okay so now let's come back to the question so name we have to name the places that these centers have been launched so guys the centers are maharashtra and jharkhand in maharashtra in aurangabad district while in jharkhand uh, jharkhand panchayat uh, 
पंचायती राज इंस्टीट्यूशन को स्ट्रेंथन करने के लिए उनके 150 विलेजेस को कवर किया जाएगा राइट एंड नाउ लेट्स कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर 3 दिस गाइस क्वेश्चन नंबर 3 इज अबाउट बीका इंडिया एंड ऑस्ट्रेलिया हैव साइंड दिस एग्रीमेंट बीका यू मस्ट हैव हर्ड ऑफ दिस सो दिस क्वेश्चन गाइस इज वेरी इजी इट कैन बी आस्क इन एग्जाम बट दिस न्यूज़ इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द एग्जाम ओके एग्जाम पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू से बहुत ज्यादा इंपॉर्टेंट है इंडिया और यूएस ने ये बीका एग्रीमेंट साइन कर लिया है बट बिफोर डिस्कसिंग दिस न्यूज़ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट रीसेंट अपडेट्स अबाउट द इंडिया यूएस रिलेशंस so recently if you had uh, if you have heard about the exercise passage okay ek exercise abhi uh, indian navy ne conduct kara tha jiska naam tha passage uh, passage and its full form is passage exercise okay passage exercise was conducted by indian navy in this exercise indian navy has used us navy's largest carrier okay us navy ka largest carrier hai jiska naam hai nimitz okay it was used by indian navy during this exercise which is known as passage all right You all uh, must have heard about the news where India provided hydroxychloroquine to the United States of India during the coronavirus pandemic, and also uh, there are some more updates. Like for example, uh, Apache and Chinook helicopter. If you talk about Apache and Chinook helicopter, India has bought it from USA, and also USA has twenty billion dollars. Okay, USA has authorized twenty billion dollars of uh, export sales to India. and so these are some recent updates about india us relations and now talking about this agreement so before this agreement uh, bika already three agreements have been signed which are general security and military information agreement that was in 2002 then we have logistics exchange memorandum uh, memorandum of agreement which in short is known as limoa that was signed in the year 2016 then we have communications compatibility and security agreement which in short is is comcasa It was signed in the year 2018. This logistic exchange memorandum uh, of agreement (LEMOA) was for the logistic exchange, as the name suggests. Its name is also known. And Comcasa was for uh, establishing the better communication between the two countries. This communication was for. Okay. And let's talk about how this BICA will help both the countries. This BICA will help both the countries. This BICA will help both the countries. So it will help India to get real-time access to USA's geospatial intelligence. जो यूएसए का जियो स्पेशल इंटेलिजेंस है उसका एक्सेस इंडिया को मिल जाएगा ना हाउ विल दिस बेनिफिट टू इंडिया सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल व्हाट इज दिस जियो स्पेशल इंटेलिजेंस सो गाइस दिस इज अ टेक्निक व्हिच विद द हेल्प ऑफ व्हिच वी कैन हैव इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट एनी लोकेशन विद द हेल्प ऑफ इमेजेस इमेजेस के थ्रू किसी भी लोकेशन की इंफॉर्मेशन हमें मिल जाती है यूजिंग जियो स्पेशल इंटेलिजेंस सो इट विल हेल्प इट विल एनहांस द एक्यूरेसी ऑफ ऑटोमेटेड सिस्टम्स एंड वेपन्स लाइक मिसाइल्स So let us say यहाँ से एक इस एक पॉइंट से इंडिया ने एक मिसाइल फायर किया है and it has to be uh, targeted यहाँ पे उसको आगे फायर करना है. So with the help of geospatial intelligence, these locations can be identified more accurately as compared to the older system and this missile will hit properly and very accurately with the help of this geospatial intelligence of USA. Okay, and it will also help India to access topographical and aeronautical data that will help in uh, navigation and targeting. and how it will help usa so guys you all know ki usa ka jo recent plan hai that is to enhance its influence in the indo pacific region and without india that is not possible okay so with the help of this agreement usa is planning to enhancing uh, is planning to enhance its influence in the indo pacific region okay so this is about this agreement guys and now let's come to the question so we have to identify the incorrect statements so Uh, with respect to the agreements and their purpose okay so limo is to enable secure communication so no it it was for the logistic if you know the full form then you can only then you can answer this question agar aapko full form pata hoga limo ka tabhi aap iska answer kar payenge otherwise you will not be able to answer so you have to remember you have to memorize the full form of this limo and konkasa and bika so konkasa is for exchanging military logistic no it is for establishing secure communication Bika is to get access to uh, geospatial intelligence. Yes, this is absolutely correct. While यहाँ पे क्या है ये interchange हो रखा है. Limo is to exchange the military logistics while uh, Konkasa is to enable the secure communication. All right. So which means uh, incorrect statement identify करना है. Which means option B only one and two will be the correct answer. All right. And now uh, now let's move on to the question number four and five. So guys, again uh, due to lack of news, I am bringing you two static question from the ESI section of RBI Big B. So let's discuss these questions. So given below are some pairs of environmental protocols and conventions with their purposes. Identify the incorrect pair. So ये कुछ environmental conventions और protocol हैं और उनके साथ उनके purposes लिखे हुए हैं. 
तो हमें बता रहे हैं कि कौन सा पेयर जो है वो इनकरेक्ट है सो लेट्स डू वन थिंग लेट मी गिव यू दिस क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर एंड फाइव इन द होमवर्क लाइट डाउन द आंसर ऑफ क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर एंड फाइव इन द कमेंट्स आई एल टेल यू द आंसर इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन ऑफ दीज टू क्वेश्चन ओके सो लेट्स चेक योर मेमोरी हाउ शार्प इज यू और आपका जो तैयारी है वो किस लेवल का है so you have to identify the incorrect pair take the screenshot of this question you have to answer the question in the comment section okay so you have to identify the incorrect pair of these protocols or conventions with their purposes all right and question number 5 this also you have to answer in the comment section so consider the following statements regarding world trade organization world trade organization ke regarding kuch statements hai and we have to identify the incorrect statement okay so ministerial conference is the highest decision making body of the wto and wto is headed by director general whose term is 5 years and wto is an organ of united nations and these are the options you have to tell the correct answer and question number 4 or question number 5 dono ka answer aapko comment mein likh ke batana hai please take the screenshot of this question also okay and guys that's it for the session i hope aapko ye session clear tha and please comment mein dono question ke question number 4 or 5 ka answer zarur likhe अगर आपको आते हैं तो नहीं आते हैं तो भी कोई बात नहीं एक बार अटेम्प्ट जरूर करें ठीक है आई विल टेक यू द आंसर इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वाचिंग मिलते हैं कल के सेशन में गुड बाय टेक केयर एंड गॉड ब्लेस